hosting a dinner party and one of your guests asks you for recommendations of an awesome new TV show to watch. Excitedly, you raise your wine glass in the air and shout, Real Cat Punchers of Indiana! And you've spilled wine all over your dress shirt. Well, worry not, friends. We've got you covered. Here are ways to clean common stains. For red wine stains on clothes, you'll need salt, a white towel, and strangely enough, white wine or unflavored club soda. Pour salt onto the stain if it's still fresh, but don't pat or rub it in. After a couple of minutes, rinse it off with warm water. To keep the stain from setting, you can pour white wine or club soda onto it. Use a white towel to blot the stain so you can see how much red you're removing. For carpet spills, you can use the same process. White wine, again, works surprisingly well, but you can also use high proof clear liquor which is a thing that I don't have around. And so if you're in that kind of situation, you can use unflavored club soda. Again, I don't have that around, but I tell you what, if I got into a world where suddenly it was like wine stains are a possibility in my lifestyle, I'm gonna go get these things. These are the ingredients that are gonna prevent my catastrophe. Club soda and hard, clear liquor. Yep. That's where the party's at. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Keep applying the liquor to the stain while soaking it up with the towel until it disappears. For berry stains, you'll need dish soap and hydrogen peroxide. First, scrape off any excess with a spatula or plastic knife. Then apply a hydrogen peroxide formula using half a teaspoon of dish soap and half a cup of hydrogen peroxide. Rinse and put it in the laundry. <laughs> Wrap it in a blanket. Why? <laughs> Number one, if you're gonna do it, you have to commit to it. I'm sorry. <laughs> right. Number two, you know how I feel about that. You know, there is something of a campaign afoot in the comment section. Is there? That the catchphrase is wrapping a blanket. Well, you guys! <laughs> I'm team not that catchphrase, or there's team Mike. So, yeah. we're gonna need to talk about this at length. <laughs> how about good old ketchup? First, treat the stain with a stain remover like shout. Then take white vinegar, if the stain remains, and use a toothbrush, believe it or not, to brush it in and remove the stain. I wanted to yell shout when you said shout, but I, I didn't want to throw you I off am your game. A little bit louder now. <laughs> Good old mustard. Mix a half teaspoon of dish soap, a half cup of water, and a few drops of white vinegar. Apply the solution to the mustard stain and allow to soak. Rinse well with hot water and launder. Chocolate. Scrape off any excess chocolate from the cloth. By the way, is there such a thing as excess chocolate? But when it's on your clothes, I would probably call that excess. It's wasted is what it is. But, there. You know. Then spray the stain with a dish soap solution, which is going to be made from one tablespoon of clear soap mixed with 10 ounces of water. Finally, dab it with detergent and launder immediately. For grass stains, you can use a stain remover, clean toothbrush, and bleach. Treat the stain with a stain remover like shout and let sit for 15 minutes. You can rub in the solution with the clean toothbrush. If the stain remains, launder with bleach that's safe with that type of fabric. Blood. So this applies to me big time because of my life fighting crime. To quote real simple, if the stain is still wet, soak fabric in cold water immediately. Rub the stain well with a bar of soap, lathering gently. Tip, for light colored fabrics, dab with hydrogen peroxide, which acts as bleach. If the stain is already dried, spray it with stain removal solution, which is one part ammonia to two parts water. Ink in clothes. This is complicated. There are at least three different types of ink and they all call for different cleaning strategies. We're gonna put some links to our favorite articles, RE ink stain cleaning in the doobly-doo below. In general, for ink stains on clothing, act fast. Once it dries, the ink is harder to clean. Now, we consider ourselves semi-professional adults and even we were really surprised by how many ways there are to clean like every stain. There's just a ton of material we couldn't fit into this video, but you can find some of it in the doobly-doo below. So what stain solutions do you use? Do you have any stain fighting tips? We would love to hear from you in the comment section below. In the meantime, maybe by the time the next dinner party rolls around, we're gonna have that catchphrase sorted out. We had that catchphrase sorted out, but I spilled wine on it. We will let you know when the stain comes out. If the stain comes it's out. It's gonna come out. We had foolproof tips. That's true. <laughs>